Hi, I'm Anne Mwawodo. Here's your channel's TV Evening News Recap for October the 14th, 2022. The Academic Staff Union of Universities, ASU, has suspended its eight-month-old industrial action. However, the union says its demands have not been satisfactorily addressed. ASU said it suspended the strike after a series of appeals by Nigerians, President Muhammadu Buhari, and the intervention of the Speaker of the House of Representatives, Femi Bajabi Amila. And on the political scene, the presidential candidate of the Labour Party, Peter Obi, has admitted that there were some omissions and erroneous entries in the party's presidential campaign council list released on Wednesday. Mr Obi has now promised a review on the list, which generated lots of controversies among supporters and opposition. On the international scene, Prime Minister Liz Truss of Britain has fired her finance minister, Kwasi Kwarteng, and partly reversed a tax plan that had rattled global financial markets, unsettled investors, and set off a spiraling crisis that still threatens her political survival. And in sports, Nigeria's Flamingos have bounced back from their opening game defeat against Germany by thrashing New Zealand 4-0 at the ongoing FIFA Under-17 Women's World Cup. And that's the evening news recap. Please visit channelstv.com for details of these stories and more. I'm Anne Mwawadu. Thank you for watching.